the estate of an iconic Springfield figure, the late Juanita Kay and John Q. Hammonds has been sold to a Springfield couple. Color 10's Jesse Inman visited the home today and met with the new owners who plan to revitalize the unique property. Jesse. Yeah, Jen, the home sits on just under three acres in the Southern Hills neighborhood, and its new owners plan to restore this home that was built in 1978. And I also spoke with a longtime friend of the Hammonds family who has fond memories of the Hammonds home. The longtime home of John Q and Juanita K. Hammonds has been sold. John Q passed away in 2013, Juanita K in 2014. Retired MSU Athletic Director Bill Rowe was a family friend. He says the house has been empty since the great 07 ice storm that paralyzed much of Springfield. He knew the hotel had backup system at University Plaza. If I was the owner of it, I'd go there too. They had uh, two suites up on the top floor, and uh, that was 2007, I believe was the year, and they never came back to reside here. Kim Kaufman and his wife will now call this home. Oh, we've got to get used to that. After being unoccupied for about 12 years, the home needs some repairs, but the Kaufmans are well aware of the history of its previous residents. We do feel a, a sense of responsibility and heritage uh, because of Mr. Hammonds and his legacy and what he's meant for this community. And so we're going to be extremely respectful. We're going to keep uh, as much of you know the original uh, architect's intentions. Restoring the home will take some work, and anyone who knew John Q knew he had a strong work ethic. So I thought you left this work stuff in the office, but he would just laugh and say, "Well, you know, I, I've always got to have working on something." This room uh, was used by Mr. Hammonds as an office. Kaufman has some inspiration to help guide his intent to keep Hammonds' heritage intact. This desk. This is where Mr. Hammonds uh, probably consummated a lot of. Uh, incredible deals down down through the years. That little bit of history we're very pleased was left behind. The property is brimming with character inside and out, and the Kaufmans will take on the task of making this house that once belonged to a legendary Springfield family a home once again. As soon as we can make it happen, we will. And the Kaufmans currently live in the Southern Hills area, but did not discuss the price of their new home. But it has many amenities, a little less than 5,000 square feet. The four-bedroom home sits just off of a small lake in the Southern Hills neighborhood. And Kim told us his wife is reading Mr. Hammond's book as they work to restore this beautiful piece of property, which they estimate could take up to six months or more. Jen?